Today is the measurement day. For the chicken coop. Once again, there is a mango tree on the top of the roof. Now guys, I wrap that mango tree for the new chicken cup. Look at that, guys. Look at that chicken go up. Maybe around 150 to 200 square meter. The chicken go up. But I can make a like a second layer because it is like around 10 meters. Yeah. Hello guys, before anything else, I would like you to introduce my 17 decals and they are about to be transferred soon in a bigger area. Guys, this is my decal. They're very sweet. Oh, my camera, please. Oh my god, another decal is getting curious. <laughs> oh, ouch! Ouch! No, 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 no. Shh, don't get curious to yourself. <laughs> Thank you for the egg. Thank you for the egg. Oh, God. <laughs> There's one curious here. Look at that. Ah! Hi! Huh? Come on. Hey, come on, come on, come on. <laughs> I hate these guys. We only like lay egg in one nest. And it's very, very annoying. Hello. Hi. <laughs> Look at that. Look at that. So nice. Hey guys! Okay. Okay. Mm. I love it. I love to be like, you know, for example, like this. Lack of attention. Why, why, why you have to be lack of attention? Huh? These are my decal. These are the original 17 egg layer. <laughs> hey. And even if I just leave it open, they will never jump in there. Lucky for them, there is a chili on the side. Guys, I just leave you there, okay? So to continue my video about my big chicken coop, this is for the egg layer. So currently, this is the egg crunch of my coop. This is the egg. And every morning, I'm going to open this 
every time I finish feeding them, they will go in that area. And they will have like, oh, this is big. Ha, I found. Ooh, it's ripe, mango. Let me bring you to inside of the co-op. So, it is already done. All the screens are intact. Rat proof. It's already rat proof. Rat proof. Everything is rat proof. Except the one in there on the top. I don't think that is a rat proof. The one on the corner. And also, I'm going to put a cage over there. And also some rubber to stop the water because it's leaking over here. And I want this area to be totally dry because I'm going to cover all the, this like a wood chip and like the rice hull yes everything this is so fresh so there is no accumulation of ammonia or anything <sighs> nothing nothing this one will be like um totally like dry and my chicken will be happy oh this is rat proof all right rat proof rat proof and then in here there's a uh, rat proofing okay so that's the only one that is opened for now. <clears throat> Once I bring the uh, the wood chip, then I can transfer my chicken, the 17 over here, and they can roam around. All my heritage are there. All the female of my heritage or the young ones, I'm going to transfer it also here <clears throat> because I have actually i have um esther eager um a chicken which is lay a blue egg it's not really like blue bluish it's just a bluish and it is very nice i'm going to <clears throat> like i let the uh, the community here taste the egg the bluish egg yeah it's it's good so yes guys but in here there is a big hole over here. This is supposed to be a septic tank, but my mom, my mom stopped the construction. And yeah, that's it. This is it. I'm going to transfer this one into a beautiful, like very noisy chicken area. And hopefully um, they will grow fast so I can earn money and also I can have it, you know, make it more bigger in the future. <clears throat> and yeah, while earning and having a chicken, I can pick up also the mangoes. Guys, the mango is bearing fruits like 365 days a year. So only the wind, <clears throat> the bird, and the rats were going to harvest it. If I will not, you know, so fast, then they will harvest it. So far, everything is fine. Everything is good. I will just get, I will just have it clean it up. 
and then after cleaning it up uh, after the uh, the wood chip and the um, uh, rice hull then it will be ready and then some of the uh, laying also some of the hands laying I'm going to put it in there they will be like good buddies actually hey what you're doing there my bantam look at that courting another bantam that bantam is courting that yeah I have some of the uh, chicken over here they're just laying egg or well, maybe this roaster because this roaster is a decalb so I think I can I can put him here inside make the uh, the egg fertile and you know but I don't know how fertile it will be because he's alone and I think he's quite old hopefully it's not more than two years old otherwise I will put some injection and he will be he will be um, you know start the uh, producing salmon again anyway thanks like and subscribe guys